Hello there, this is Space Number 5, and welcome back to episode 15 of our Norway Let's Play series, where today we're going to go ahead and con er, continue our conquest of the Americas, since, well, today hopefully I'm going to go ahead and take the rest of South America, uh, and we'll just have to finish colonizing our little bits here and there, and then we're going to continue our expansion over here in North America, hopefully eating all of Mexico, uh, since, well, England uh, worked so hard, took all the aggressive expansion to take all this, and now we're just going to take it from them, uh, is what I'm planning. Well, we can do a, do a little bit of cleanup work over here, and we, we can look to go ahead and expand over here a little bit if Novgorod's got some claims. Uh, Novgorod, you have not made any claims. Can, can we uh, specify you to actually get claims? Uh, I'm, I'm okay with feeding you guys. Uh, you just gotta... You just have to ask for it. That's it. I'm pretty sure we have claims on Kazan, courtesy of Novgorod. So, depending on who you're allied with, uh, you're not allied with the Ottomans. It looks like the Ottomans were at war with you. Uh, the Commonwealth Joint? Yeah, actually, let's just do this. This is fine. We're, we're gonna feed Novgorod here. Uh, we... Sure, I knew this is fine. Go for that. That's fine. Go. Go do that. I'm gonna go ahead and start working on dealing with Portugal. Everyone left our, our coalition, which is great. Alright, you guys are walking over here. You guys are walking here as well. There is a Joffrey here. Uh, he has decided to jump up on the desk, per usual. All right, you guys take that. I will do this. What do you want to give me? Uh, base tax five, have a manufactory. I'm definitely inclined to have a manufactory. What does it produce? I'm hoping iron or copper. It does, good. I'm good with this. Uh, we need to do this anyways. Oh wait, no, it needs to be inside the Norwegian area, but also this is still just a good place to have it. Uh, we'll do that later. And I also did realize that we haven't given out the plus one military point, which is actually totally fine. Uh, I'm not sure I care about this. This is strong duchies. This is still fine. Uh, we can give out the nobility integration policy to make this guy a little cheaper, but we can wait. Since right now we're still paying full price, uh, 5% is what we're going to see on the discount. So, little little rebels there. That's fine. There's a colony done. Good. Uh, can I get another colonist? Can I send him here? No, because this colony is not done. Uh, look, more tropical wood. We need that. All right. Um, we can go ahead and colonize. I guess why don't we go and call that colonize down this coast so we can see if we can trap this in here. Uh, I want to I want to try to start sectioning areas off uh, so that way uh, no one else can continue colonizing uh, since right now we're fighting England over here as well. So England did make their way over here so we're gonna deal with the English over here I guess that's fine. And Great Colonial Nation I'll just take it from them. I, I want to start blocking people off though. Oh this is the discipline event. It's a little early. Earlier than I'd like it. I'd like to use it when we fight the Ottomans but I guess this will do. Uh, we'll go for I don't really care. Any forts nearby? Yeah this one. There, go, down. Oh, there's actually quite a few ports over here. And I do want another army kind of in this area since uh, we're gonna have to try and maintain all of this. It's gonna be kind of a pain in the butt to maintain, especially when that happens. Here, go deal with that and then uh, go there. That'll work. Uh, we are heading to military tech, so I don't really mind doing artillery barrages and we'll take, I think, pretty much all of Peru in this one more, right? That's kind of what I'm thinking. Uh, we could do the entire coastline so we get cheaper later on anyways. So like we can do we can do slower uh, gobbles is kind of what we can do. So we can do these slow wars. Uh, obviously it's less AE. I would like to see if I can get over here, but or rather it's less diplo point intensive, um, which is fine. And I don't really want you to have a navy, and I need to be able to get access over here. So this is fine. I think we'll do the slower wars um, for at least a little while. Um, just so it conserves our dipple points, and I want to conserve those for annexations, and I don't necessarily need all this clay yet. Um, and plus I'm not really fighting mainland Portugal at the moment, I'm just... We exist. Uh, it's kind of how we're, we're, we're slow rolling it. So, I guess take that. Can I, oh, I'm not at war with Portugal, so I can't seize this. Uh, is this part of... Oh, this would be part of Brazil. Okay, so the colony done here. We are being set there, or rather that's Portugal, going ahead and colonizing there. Let's go ahead and continue. More rebels, not surprised, that was the war goal as well. Uh, not enough war score for us to go ahead and take the thing, so... Oh, that's our own fort. Alright, let's go take that one. Yeah, we'll just do a slow push. And you're already done. Yeah, you guys are doing great, except I want to feed more, so... Uzbek, I don't care what happens to you, that's upsetting. Well, if I get the stab back, I guess I'm also good with that. Moscow, uh, we're gonna let the Commonwealth deal with that. Let's give as much land over to Kazan. Kazan, are you going to get more... Or, Kazan, no guy. You're going to get more claims as part of this? Because uh, I, I will feed you as, as much as possible. Even if it costs me more dimple points, I will, I will feed you. Uh, Novgorod, there you go. That looks like a good chunk. And what do you have for missions, Novgorod? Defeat Muscovy. Gives you claims on stuff in the south, which is good. So we can immediately go after you guys, uh, which I'm fine with. 
I'm gonna let the Commonwealth. I'm, I'm gonna let them fight these. This 33k. I'm pretty sure the Commonwealth will help us with that. Did you just destroy my colony? Pretty sure that's what he just did. Go. I don't expect being in this war for, for actually that long. Just Dis dispatch those rebels. Let's go over there for a hot second. Their leaders are trash. <laughs> Where's our iron tradition at? Uh, it's at 40. Uh, we, we've actually continued to lo lose our forts. Let's uh, let's upgrade some of our forts. Uh, sort by costs. There you go. Those ones are level twos. We can make them level fours. So I'm not going to prioritize any of them at this point. Uh, there's another colony self standing. It was not this one. So let's go ahead and colonize here just to go ahead and kind of block them off a little bit more. I'm assuming they're going to the war goal, which I don't care about. Um, and you did deal with those. Thank you. Appreciate it. And we're just going to go for free stuff. There you go. And nicer borders. There's a fort there. I want that. This will be fine. This is 60 AE for this. Oof. I guess we're going to slow roll a little bit. Take, give me this and give me a works. And keep all your... Oh, you have lots of cores on the Ottomans. I don't think I'm going to vassalize you. I mean, it's a bunch of free. It's it's so cheap over here. I don't need this. This is fine. Give us all of Novgorod. Uh, it's Sunni, so you actually convert it. Uh, since uh, you can't really convert the Orthodox territory, so I mean, you're gonna slow roll that anyways. That's good. I expect you to get claims. Do you claim? There's your clip. Good. All right. We can go eat this guy real quick. Oh, here's a vassal to come. Along. Never mind. Go after you though. Mm, no. Let's not do that right now. I do want to tell the bridge here. I did good. Uh, where's this army over there? Go deal with that and go there. Where's your capital? As well, there. Oh, who's got? Yeah, that kind of makes sense for that to be your capital. Uh, it's typically, you're gonna be your high step province. We'll see if we get anything. Let's see. Uh, I, I'm gonna wait there with a bated breath for sure, though. I don't think we're gonna get anything. But hey, if we do, we do. I'm not gonna be too certain, concerned. Uh, there was rebels somewhere. In Novgorod? Yeah, they're always in Novgorod. Novgorod's got all kinds of issues. Uh, we are not the ones who got there first. Uh, let's go to Novgorod. Look, they got permanent claims. They can have it. That's all I'm saying. Great efficiency sounds good. Printing press is here. Excellent. Uh, we're going to send you here. Hello. Because I don't control this province? Yes, yeah, because I don't control it. I guess that's fine. Alright, let's go colonize down here then. That's fine. I have a second option to cut you off, so I'm not too concerned about it. Um, no, I don't care about this one. What does this one give us? Max protocultures, promote culture costs? No, I don't care about that. I don't care about that one. This is nice to have. Oh, actually, we have the islands over here somewhere. Right? Or you can still get that. Uh, oh, I can still got it. Uh, this is Global Settlers. It just means more colonization, so yeah, it's fine. I thought I built another one. I have no idea where it's at, though. If, uh, if there's another one. Minus 11? I mean, I'm not asking for too much, I don't think. I think 100 ducats. How much did that do I have? Oh, one loan? Yeah, let's pay that off. Save us a little bit of money. Uh, another, yeah, you, I mean, you guys can occupy it. It's fine. Let's go step on your capital to flip you to low. Pretty much immediately. Uh, no, you'll just go to nine. Uh, so you only get minus five reasons. But with that fort falling, you stepping on the capital, we should be good. I'm okay with you keeping quite a few forts as well. I'm not uh, concerned about that. And we'll just take money from you. 141 ducats. I mean, that's fine. There you go. Now you're just in my pocket. And then we'll just slowly eat you. Well, that. And I think we're going to move up one area to go after you. English Columbia. I have a truce with you. For how long? Oh, it's almost up. July. All right, you need to go deal with those rebels. We'll keep the other army kind of in that area. And we're going to be capped on military points, in fact. Hmm. Do I need to claim on you? There's not much territory over here. Uh, I don't really need to support rebels. You have a truce with you. I have an army already here. Uh, just have you suppress rebels. Uh, the rebellions are, are... They still definitely occur. They're just a little slightly less frequent as we go ahead and convert more stuff. Um, which is good. I don't mind that. 
I'm assuming it's time to refresh these, I would imagine. This is a new recording session, so I have no idea if uh, they actually need to be refreshed. And I do want this for Missionary Strength. There you go. Refresh Thatch. That is still nothing I can colonize. And we're going to go colonize here. Oh, they colonize there, so let's go colonize here then. Uh, Portuguese Brazil almost has everything they can have. Yep. Uh, Peru's colonizing that. Very nice. You do that. Um, do I want a harsh treatment anything? Maybe. Preceptus. It doesn't really do me any good. The age of absolutism is almost here, and I'd rather wait for that. So I do this now. Mm, maybe. This would make you 10% cheaper as well. We can throw military points somewhere. Yeah, throw them there. Fine. Um, yeah, we chill. Settlers increase. I mean, you have Particulus. That sucks for you. Uh, England, our truce is still a thing. You're allied with Portugal. Okay, so you still... Oh, you actually have 100 dudes. I think we kill your colonial nations, though. That'll, that'll shrink. That is on the list of things to do. Uh, this army is the one who's going to deal with that. I will take the... Yeah, we're going to fix this ourselves. If you're on your way. Take a new dude. There you go. He's actually pretty decent. Don't mind if I do. Uh, this is our lovely disloyal subject, which is pretty typical. Denmark going to go deal with... Oh, Denmark's going to deal with them for us. I think I'll take the 100 pop. Yeah, you're, this is all Inca, so this is all uh, going to be a little unruly for a little while. That's all good to go. I do need to build my manufacturer. I will not forget about it. Let's build this. There you go. Extra whole ducket. Sounds great to me. Internal conflicts in the Zia Federation. Sure. This is someone else that you. Do I have a CB on you? No. You have claims? You still have the strangest claim network. Not really concerned about this. Uh, in all reality, there's our truce with the colonial nations. Do we? I think we each you first. Yeah. Who's this? Oh, English Columbia. Interesting. We'll just go. Not really uh, concerned about you uh, doing anything to me. I don't need to call Castile in, and yeah, we'll just be good to go. Where are you sitting your capital? Another colony damage. I can't, I'm not really concerned if they're damaged at this point. We get 150 per year. I'm really not concerned at all. Uh, we need to go check on this over here as well. Yeah, get the knock rod. Um, it'll go away. Crypt protection. That's okay. You're embargoing me. I honestly don't care if you embargo me at all. just for nice borders, and then this one little province. There you go. That's all I want. 139 double points. Yeah, that's fine. Double points are just a number, right? <laughs> they don't matter. Especially when we're uh, not even behind. Ooh, I do want this admin efficiency, though. Uh, I'll pay for that to get that in advance, because that also makes you cheaper. So how are we doing over here? Are we still... Uh, okay, we're under our gut cap. That's good. Good, good, good. All that is decent. Stuff got a little bit cheaper. Minus 23 reasons. Got some rebels. Aren't you going to deal with us? Oh, no. Uh, go deal with them. Though, though. Send you there themselves. Good. What do you got? Is your strength? Sure. Yes, I will take that. That shall help us convert over to more Protestantism. This is the war goal, I would imagine. Yeah. Not activating the war goal is kind of an issue. Wars, rebels. Let's go deal with that real quick. This guy has lots of problems, and he still isn't converted. Uh, we'll take this out of time. Go, just for some innovativeness. You're on medium. I think you're going to flip the low low right now. I guess walked over or teleport. Doesn't particularly matter. It's just one of those things that you notice. You flipped the low. <laughs> Would love it if you would flip the low. Alright, so that will be this guy gone. More rebels. Yes, our subject has lots lots of issues. We're not surprised at all. We'll help him. Uh, let's not have Castile pissed off there. Actually, a friend of those 100 ducats. That's fine. More rebels. More, more rebels. Rebels all over the place. Sent you there. Ah, that one's actually going to rise up and actually kind of be an issue. Rebels over there. Yeah, yeah, I mean, we got lots of rebels in our country. They're just numbers. 
Uh, minus 14. I need you to flip low. What makes you think... Oh, oh you are in the process of exploding. I, I guess it's been, uh, been a couple years, and it's now time for them to do their, 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 uh, their normal thing. So as long as you guys don't spawn every, like, year and a half, you'll be fine. More rebels for us. That's Novgrad rebels. I think Commonwealth will deal with those guys, though. Um, and you're just kind of, yeah, you're gonna have to walk around. It, it, it's just that annual, or that, you know, every 10 years we just have that. It's fine. They're just rebels. They'll get put down. How are you not on low? You don't want to be full annexed? I mean, I understand your desire not to be full annexed. I'm telling you, it's it's silly. It's a silly notion. Uh, go kill this little 2k. They're not gonna have an army after that. And Brunswick's the only one without an army. Sure. Yes, I see you fleeing like the coward that you are. But colony done. I guess I don't want to. I want to keep colonizing down here. See, like this is why. See, Portugal's already colonizing here. So let's go ahead and see if we can cut this off right here. I don't have a colonist. Never mind. We just completed a colony. Uh, I mean, right now it's mostly. Yeah, it's it's you are having problems. How do we get this? I don't remember giving that to you. Are you still expanding? <laughs> kind of looks like it. Uh, there's another colony done. Uh, we did cut them off here. They got a gold producing cross. That's fine. Go there. You're gonna go do with those guys. Good. 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 You ready to go? No, you're still unwilling to to die. Okay, fine. We'll continue to help you. Um, there is. I mean, you still can kind of think that you have an army. That's fine. More rebels! Yeah, because we're really surprised by that. Okay, you got that covered. Go include these two provinces, too. There you go. Okay. Made peace. Uh, now I've got a core. Or a province. Very nice. There. Someone else reacted by all this. It's fine. You are still insisting on exploding. It was at 1%, or it was at 0% there for, or 0, for just the briefest of moments. I understand it's going to be a full annexation. Why does it get mi minus 89 reasons? You're tiny, insignificant, and you are a bump in the road. There you go, go away. We got You. Uh, we'll give you this province. There you go. Enjoy. I'm going to keep that one for myself. I already have court. Court, there you go. You're kind of inside of me. I kind of want you to go away. <laughs> I don't like the fact that you're next to me and kind of within my borders. Uh, do I have a CV on you? I'd eat you real quick now. We'll clean you up later. Uh, you guys are really insignificant as far as I'm concerned. You're dealing with those guys. You're going over there. Good. And then we're going to go after the Columbia here. Uh, yeah, that'll be fine. And we're just going to try and push in. I also have lots of ducats. Don't care about that one. Don't care about that one. Uh, I do want Malta to be upgraded for war score cost against, against other religions. White House is also an option for state governing costs. I mean, we're not a republic, so no re-election costs for us. Don't care about that. This one I do care about, except I don't own it. If I owned it, I'd care more. Don't care about that one. This one I do care, but yeah, it gives me an extra missionary. I do want that one. Let that go, and then we'll do the Malta port next. Oh, we'll make plenty of money. You need to reseed your stuff faster. Um, we have oh, we have rebels over here. Those are the thirteen colonies. Cool. That'll work. You're dealing with that. You're on your way there. Good. I need our I need more armies so that we can go ahead and move around a little bit more. Can I afford it? Not quite. Soon-ish. If you guys don't move, I'm also good with that. Oh, you evidently uh, lost your dude. That's fine. If uprising, I lose 10,000 manpower. That's uh, atrocious. Where's this other revolt? It's not over here. It must be in Novgorod. Yeah, it's in Novgorod. Novgorod, you can deal with it, though. You're actually uh, a decently sized dude at this point. Uh, I would like to get your being sent there. We'll send you there, so that way all this will be blocked off. Self-nobility, colony damage, that's fine. 
Uh, the colonies will still finish uh, in a decent amount of time. Don't really care about the patch. Let's go over here. You don't have to take 16 out and cover for progress. I would prefer not to lose it, but I also don't want to keep losing stab. Uh, needlessly. 113. He's pretty trash. And for English Columbia, I think we're just going to peel off another little layer. That's a level 4 fort. I do want that. We have the three siege dude right over here. Yeah, over here from the north. From this army. Uh, you can take that guy and go right by that. You'll be good. France is still here. I do have a core, so they could technically colonize here if they really wanted to. I mean, I'm okay if they don't, so. More revolts. We're very used to them at this point. Uh, everything else seems stable over here. You guys are all in position. We're just waiting for that army to come back up. What upgrade centers of trade? I think so. This will just be more money in our pocket since we are collecting here. This one makes no difference to me at all. Uh, this is also the North Sea. Yes. It will eventually pay for itself in a very, very long period of time, which is also fine. I don't care. I don't need to be noted about, not, notified about these. Um, you're currently at war with England, or with Brunswick, brought in with Bite. Yes, all of that made sense in my head. They're currently fighting Brunswick because England's there, which is fine. We'll go for this. It's a little... Let's go there. Yep. Well, it's not over here. Of course, it's inside this guy. Why would I? Why would I think otherwise? It's either here or Novgorod. It's one or the other. Also, what are you guys? You guys are still hunting ships, aren't you? No, you're not doing anything right now. Leave this boat. I guess I can just send you to the New World. If we're fighting Columbia. My oh, and your capital's there. Yeah, yeah. Send you over here. Colony damaged. Oh no. Anyways. Okay, so Peru can't grow anymore, then we'll just do future wars. Gain some corruption, that sucks. Just cost us money, though. Up there, and, oh, the fleet's already there. That was quick. Uh, do an artillery brush here. Yeah, this is level 4 I'm gonna take uh, his forts uh, as part of this, just so it's gonna be easier for future wars, and then I just wanna get borders as many as possible. Lose some prestige, not a big deal. We are losing money, also not that big of a deal. I need you to actually be able to, like, be stable. I can't babysit you all the time. Like, look. We're, we're stable. Uh-ish. I mean, all of the land I've recently conquered is unstable, but that's, that's a different thing. That's expected. Can you stand there without suffering? Oh, yeah. Just stand there, then. Help him. There we go. Can't really help there, but that's fine. There you go. Continue. Colony damage. Sure. I'll uh, we'll send the dude here, so that way you can't have another colony. Yep, there's Portuguese Brazil. Hey, guess what? I'm gonna I'm gonna eat that guy. Uh, because he's next to me. I will do that. All right. Uh, I don't really want to stay to fight anything else. We're good. We're on. Oh, wait, I took your capital. Good. Denmark's here. I mean, everyone's here. Like this is not an issue. You have nineteen thousand over there. Also, oh, there's your other bit. Okay, so I see your entire army. Both stacks. Clear agenda. Fantastic. Uh, do I want to start another one? I don't think so. I think we're fine. Give me everything that is zero diplo points, and then we're going to go. Give me that. This will be fine. Actually, I want this so we have zone control. Oh, yeah, it's with Portugal. That's fine. We'll take that in future war. Uh, I just want another fort. And this just pushes borders. By one. I don't really care if you have a navy, either. This is 50 AE for 11. It's also 85 diplo points. That is an expensive province. Oh, it's 23 dev, I guess. But it has a fort on it. Did I pay diplo points for it? That's 40 diplo points for a fort. Maybe not. Yeah, let's not. Let's just uh, take our things. We'll have short cruises and we'll slowly eat them. This is one war score for all that, too. Uh, give me... I mean, you're going to give me all your money. If I can, I'm going to bankrupt you. Look, you're just a little fly and I'm just going to swat you down. I, you, you don't matter. Oh, you're actually... Uh, 
Oh no, you don't take the werewolf back, that's fine. I mean, yeah, you're just gonna get beat up, I think, so. Go ahead and Carpet Siege, we're just gonna take more money. Especially with that fort falling. I mean, you're just basically paying for our, our conquest right now. What is this one? This is Diplo Relations plus two. I actually am inclined to have a Diplo Relation. We can let that one go slow. It'll be a slow burn, but I'm also good with the slow burn. Um, are these colonies almost done? Is it a different colonial region? Oh, it is. Oh, okay. Well, then we can just eat this guy. You see Parliament. They're not anywhere near me. We're gonna get rid of this Brazil, though. This Brazil's uh, mildly annoying. Uh, is it time to go after Mexico? Mm, probably Notch. I don't have anything adjacent to him, so I don't actually have a nice CB. Guess I'll send you there so I can at least get something. We can slowly eat him from this way. We need to defend Denmark. I don't want to lose my personal union. I worked hard for you. I, I worked hard for you a long, long time ago, but I still want to lose you. Yes, I will do this. Okay. I will send him here next. I mean, yeah, I'm going to send it here, so... Oh, no. Yeah, you're right. You're fine, and we're going to colonize here. Go. Have at it. You guys are a little unruly. It's okay. And you're just going to walk down here. And we're going to eat all of Brazil in one war. It's going to cost us nothing. Uh, we're already dealing with that as well. Good. Good, good, good. Uh, yeah. Brazil's going to fall really quick. Sure. I don't know why you expect my support in these endeavors, but sure. Can you hit that armor? Yeah, I can't get it. Calling self standing, that's the one that we recalled from, so that's not a big deal. Stack white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, nothing. Take the dip points. Stipple points are good. You're, okay, you're going to be the one to deal with it. That work and give us another colonist, please. I want him back. This is just for our growth. Take sides of Parliament, not a big deal. Bribe. Lose one legitimacy. Uh, if I don't have to pay the money, I'm not. You can lose sailors, so it doesn't matter. You can have autonomy. Or exhaustion also doesn't matter. Lose naval tradition. Naval tradition is always pretty good for us at this point. Uh, let's not piss off Denmark. Denmark needs to be happy with us. Yeah, go there. We're just going to completely cut them off. They're going to be able to form another uh, Argentina, but that's okay. I don't care if you form an Argentina. Because I'm just going to eat him. Wait, what just happened? Oh, Portugal doubt on us. No. We're here to take England. Because England died without an heir. The poor got the personal union. Okay. I mean, I'll take an England. Not really prepared for this, but that's fine. Uh, let's go to speed four. I was really not prepared for this. Uh, this is fine. You do not accept your flying stage. That's fine. Uh, let's get to start occupying stuff. I wasn't I was planning on eating this guy. Uh, we have to fight the entire, basically, New World right now, and I don't have armies in any of the right locations. How many troops does England have over here? Enough for me to be concerned? Is the answer? I need another army. Or a bigger army over here. What's combat with? 30? Let's think. How much do you have, England? 100,000? 
50? I'm looking at 50k right there. So that's half of it. Still a lot of converting we have to do. You'll be able to take London. I understand it'd be called multiple wars, but... I don't want you on one. I wish I could be like, join this one specifically. Build that. One with the thicker again? Okay, so cannons actually do matter. Tech 16 is when they kind of start being come, becoming relevant. That's overall force line. Eh, this will go with the 35k here. That'll be 10 artillery. I have a ton of artillery. We need more artillery is the answer. I guess we'll go over the force limit just a bit. It's fine. Um, we can always stateify more territory. So we can go ahead and get more force limit. Anyways, um, that's an option. Because this will increase our force limit because the autonomy will decrease. Uh, no, I like to center it in, the, in North America right now. We'll come back to South America, but right now we're going to deal with Canada and the U.S. for right now. Um, this is fine. Yes. Yep. Yes. Sure. Yes. This is going to cost a lot of ammo points. Uh, yes. We almost at our gov cap. Like, I just stayed fighting quite a bit. Okay, we're we're good now. Don't ignore that and core all that. Yeah, we didn't, that was that was a lot of ammo points right there. That was over 600 ammo points that we just spent. Uh, but our force limit uh, will pick up next month. There you go. We're no longer over it. Even with all of our built stuff being built, that's just good. Where's the navy? You. Okay, you're here. Uh, we're gonna defend Norway, and then this army is gonna get ferried on over. Only, yeah, you took my colony, in fact. Not really surprised by that at all. And you guys go drop up there. You'll be safe there. A little annoyed they decided to take my colony instead, but whatever. Took it down here. Um, that's fine. Why don't we go colonize some islands in the Pacific, because they'll be safe uh, from their uh, hands. That one's probably going to get lost, but it's okay. England's going to do some stuff. Yeah, we're just going to chill out. Okay, so I just have to defeat the English here, and then this island will be under our control. I really need to piece you out, though, but I don't take one province off you. You become an OPM, and then I should be able to call the Commonwealth in. Because I won't be calling them into uh, multiple wars. Uh, steal a join. I'm also fine with this. Go. Do that. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to win over here. It's kind of my thought. Yeah, because we'll have to fight all of England as well. So fall behind the fort line. It's a nice safe location. This is because you have stuff there. That's interesting. My land, though. Uh, continue coring. Uh, yeah, because I'm not going to be taking any land for a little while because of the war with England. Um, Castile just carpet siege. Seeing the 20k here from England is good. This 60k is kind of a problem. I wasn't really expecting this at all, um, but yeah. Uh, that is all the time that I have today. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, episode, make sure you guys please like and subscribe, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day.